Okay, you guys, it's Andrea. Look how stinking cute this is. This is Glossy Boxes Summer Limited Edition. I, I'm already in love with this and haven't even opened it yet. Look at this travel case. It zips open and I, I see um, Velcro on the sides. It says it is um, the Flay, the Flat Lay Co. from London, and this is for Glossy Box. I'm assuming it's gonna lay flat when you open it up. Like I said, it's a limited edition summer box. Um, if you are a subscriber, you can order this starting um, the 21st of July. And it's gonna be $30. If you're not a subscriber, you can order this starting the 22nd of July. And it's gonna cost you $35. Now, Glossy is a monthly beauty subscription. This is not part of the beauty subscription. They do limited editions quite a lot and they're always phenomenal. But if you wanna sign up and become a subscriber and get a big discount on this guy, I can also get you a discount on subscribing. It's usually 21 a month. I can save you five bucks off your first box with my code. Andrea16, I think it is. I'll put the link and my code down below um, if you want to sign up and become a member. Also, five people are gonna be, win a golden ticket in this box. Just chance of the draw. If you find a golden ticket in your limited edition summer box, you're going to win Touchlands Power Mist Bundle worth $117. Those spray hand sanitizers that look so bougie. I've got a golden ticket. No, I'm sure I don't. This because this was sent to me free for review. So I doubt they put me in the running. Huh, I'd be so excited if I was though. Let's see what's in here. I, I love this case. Okay. Opening it. Opening it. Oh my gosh. Even better. It opens to like, it looks like a drawer. It is a square basket. This is definitely going with me on our next vacay. I'm sure y'all are so sick of seeing my vacay videos. Sorry about that. Let's see what all is in here. I don't have a product guide, so we're just going to figure it out. First thing I'm pulling up is Volition Mineral Prismatic Luminizing Shield SPF 35. This says, shake well, apply over entire face 30 minutes before sun exposure. Reapply at least every two hours or as needed. Um, use a water-resistant sunscreen if swimming. So this is not, I guess, water-resistant. It's sunscreen for your face. You can always use this. I look like I'm half red, don't I? I keep noticing I look real red right here. I must have been catty cornered to the sun too long. Here's what the packaging looks like. Super cute. Uh, I think it's tinted. smell anything. Boy, it just like absorbed in. There was no white chalky overcast or anything. Let's see if I can read more about on the side of the box. Weightless breathable formula, reef safe, non nano mineral sunscreen, flawless pearl finish for invaluable radiance. Innovative, dual-purpose base, perfect skin alone or under makeup. It's a light, neutral scent. I didn't, like I said, I didn't smell anything. I just put a little dab on, but. What if, let's see. 
Our community loves the original prismatic formula, but wanted a mineral reef safe version. No more whitish cast, odor, irritation, and greasy finish. This reef safe and weightless formula nourishes and perfects skin with a kiss of hydration. Nice, I'm excited to have that. Can definitely use it every day, especially when we're at the beach. Oh, next I have a completely white box. It is a mystery what's inside. Oh my gosh, we have a whole thing of perfume in this really cool glass bottle. Yuzu a, a de perfume, perfume, something like that. A de perfume. Soli Notes Paris. Let me spray it. See how it's. I have no description on this whatsoever. Like I said, the box is completely blank except for this is for display only. Oh my gosh, it smells so good, y'all. I want to say it's very citrusy, fresh, fruity, light. Definitely citrus is how I would describe it. Oh my God, I love it. Oh my goodness. Fantastic. This is a great deal. It's already worth it with the sunscreen perfume in the bag. Next, makeup removing cloths. Makes, removes makeup using only water. I love makeup cloths. Includes three cloths. The Vintage Cosmetic Company loves all things vintage. It has created a range of bath, beauty, and cosmetic accessories inspired by the glamour and charm of the 50s. I love that too. If you get in my car any, any given Sunday or any given day, I'm playing 40s big band music. That's my jam. Beautifully produced and loved by makeup artisans and celebrities alike, these darling products are sure to add pizzazz to any girl's collection. These are cute. They're all the same. They're all stars. Now, from my experience, you're supposed to wash and dry these in your machine first and then start using them. The shorter haired side is um, for cleaning your face and the longer haired side is for exfoliation. Yay! Super happy to have these. Wash at 30 degrees Celsius. I don't know what that means, Fahrenheit. First, before use and in between uses. I'll leave to dry naturally. So this is saying not to put it in the dryer, just let it let it dry naturally after you wash it. 100% polyester. Three for three. Next. Looks like we have a sample product of nudes. All over face blush color. Okay, mini nudies matte in naughty spice. Uh, I love the color if it's that what's on the bottom. That's really pretty. Very pretty. No smell. So a cream blush. Multitasking balm on eyes, lips, and face for an easy look. Hashtag go nude, but better look. So you could use you in your eyes, lips, or cheeks. Very nice. Next. Oh, this stuff is expensive. I can't pronounce it. 
I love this brand. Love it, love it, love it. Bor Jahiz from Rome. I know I'm butchering the pronunciation. This is Crema. It's in a different language. I wish you had a product guide. I'm guessing it's um a moisturizer. I'm guessing it's a face moisturizer. Some of the first beauty products that mud mask that I have is this brand and some lotion and I absolutely loved it. I'm not smelling any scent. It looks like a very thick cream. I'm assuming a face cream. But yeah, I love this company. Y'all will probably have a, um, a product guide in yours. I'm assuming I don't just because they sent it to me free for review and it's art. They sent it to me early. Aromatherapy Associates Revive Morning Bath and Shower Oil. We got a sample of that. It's a little glass bottle. It's so stinking cute. Bath oil. What is that scent? It's a very, it smells like an essential oil. Kind of smells medic, medicative, like menthol or something. like it would um, relieve tired muscles type of scent. So yeah, put that in your bathtub or rub it on sore muscles. Tell you what, I could use it after all these vacays we've been on. I'm wore out. The ritual, add two capfuls to your bath or smooth it over your body before showering. Okay. Revive morning. Then we have by Vor Sunset Ritual Signature Conditioner. Do we have a shampoo? Oh, here's some different brand though. We have some conditioner. Massage through wet hair, focusing on the ends. Leave on for three to five minutes and rinse thoroughly. <coughs> yeah. Let's see how this smells. Oh, there's a there's a um, safety seal that I'll take one for the team and smell it for you. Popped out. You popped out on me. What the heck? What? It smells like um, a fairy fall scent, like a campfire or pumpkin spice. It reminds me of like a scentsy fall scent that you would get. Autumn, sp autumn or pumpkin. Very interesting. Very interesting. I like it. Yeah, very fall room scent smell. And then we have this Susto Moon Dust Hair Wash Mini. Shampoo, I'm assuming. What the heck? These are some of the most unique scents of any products I've gotten. What? I'm trying to put my finger on this. I want to say it kind of reminds me of pickle juice or something. Is my sniffer kaput or what? Powder. No wonder. It's powder. I can, now I can tell when I shake it. So cool. Powder to lather shampoo for everyday use. Sprinkle a small amount evenly across a wet hand. Rub hands together to activate, slide through wet hair, lather and rinse. I cannot wait to try this. I cannot wait. 
That is so cool. And lastly, we have this Boskia Firming Icy, Icy Code Cleanser. Icy Code Cleanser. Firming Icy Code Cleanser. Gently massage cleanser onto dampened face to create a cooling lather. Rinse with cold water. I love this unique stuff. You know, I get so many boxes. Of, I always get so excited when I get different products in that, to try. And I'm super excited about it. I can't wait to try that. And guys, look here. There's also a zippered pocket in this. I love this case. Absolutely love it. In this side... It's got some things for brushes to hold on the on the edges. I'm super excited about it. Okay, we got some color. Everything to make your face for summer. Think about it. Okay. First up, clean your face. Then sunscreen your face. Then moisturize your face. All in one color stick, eyeshadow, blush, lipstick. Then spritz this on to smell good. Then when you're in for the night after a day at the beach, rub some body oil on, get in the bath, powder shampoo your hair and condition it up. Oh shoot, I forgot, these guys. These guys to wash your face when you're in the bathtub. After you oil down, you wash um, wash your color stick off with this and proceed. Also fits perfectly in this customization. Great, great customization, glossy. They, somebody really thought about this. I absolutely love it. I would definitely buy this if I hadn't already had it sent to me. And I saw this, I would be like, it's gonna be mine. What do you guys think? I'm putting my bag back together. See how easy that is or hard. Thank you so much, Glossy Box, for sending this to me. I'm, I'm thrilled with this. I absolutely love it. What do you guys think? Give me a thumbs up if you like the video, guys. Subscribe if you like to watch unboxings. See you at the next one.